I would like to make an extension to the video I released earlier talking about this tweet from Eric Trump that reads, Google is once again trying to manipulate Americans. Type mob or mobs into Google and watch what comes up. Nothing, excuse me, do the same on any other search engine. Nothing to see here. Now, the video I made was pretty well received, but some people bring up fair points talking about uh, Google's history, doing sketchy things more or less. So let me emphasize in my coverage, I'm not talking about Google's history. I'm not defending them as a whole. I'm not defending their entire history. That's ridiculous. I'm just talking about this specific example. And in this specific example, I think Eric's, Eric's tweet is just silly, in my opinion. Now, I could be wrong about that. Maybe he's making a very fair point, or maybe he's joking around. Let's assume that he's serious, though. And with that assumption, let's talk about why this is a bad take. And if you want to criticize me for anything, that's totally fine. I think criticism that I am certainly warranted to receive is that what I'm going to show you in this video, I did not show in the prior video. It would have been a much better video if I did that. Also, the title of my original video is not that great. I'll, I'll be honest, man. When you make multiple videos a day, you start to run dry of ideas for titles. It, it just happens. I'll try to work on that. From what I've seen in the comment section, most of the people defending Trump's tweet which again, I'm totally fine with. I just want to emphasize my point as well because I could have done better originally, uh, are saying things along the lines of this. There is credibility to Eric Trump's tweet. Mob from Mob Psycho 100 should be farther down the list given how relatively new it is compared to the use of mob for centuries. Yet Google doesn't do the same for the plural. Mob on DuckDuckGo, pictures of a mob with Mob Psycho 100 further down on being pictures of an actual mob uh, on, on Google directly to the anime, no pictures of a mob. So this is actually kind of uh kind of a fair point but not really because when you do go to those search engines and i'll show you this in just a moment when you look up mob on bing on DuckDuckGo, on yahoo it's not showing protests or riots which are most of the comments defending uh, eric trump's take they're saying google's trying to hide the protesting or the rioting or whatever and that those other search engines are actually showing them but when you go to uh bing excuse me yahoo DuckDuckGo. The results aren't protest or riot results either. It's actually old old results from flash mob videos from 2014 and 2015. So if you want to criticize Google for censorship or hiding search results or anything like that, I think you're totally fine to do so. I just think that this specific example is really not a good example. And I think there are other examples out there that you could use that would be much better. This one to me really isn't it. See, take a look and don't just take my word for it. If you wanna check this out, you can easily do so. Here's Bing. I type in mob, I go to images and the results, all the top results. No, this is not from the current protests or riots or anything like that. This is all stuff from flash mob videos. If you click this man, look at this. It's like old flash mob videos from 2014 and 2015. So people saying that Google's just trying to hide results and Yahoo, Bing and DuckDuckGo have the proper results. I don't think that argument holds up at all. It's the same thing also for DuckDuckGo. Here's DuckDuckGo now. You look up mob, uh, green flash mob, flash mob, uh, amazing flash mob, flash mob, flash mob. It's all flash mob stuff. And you start to get to mob psycho stuff near the end of the flash mob. That's back on uh, Bing now. And now let's try Yahoo. It's the exact same thing, guys. It's just flash mob stuff. So let me again repeat the point. If you're trying to say that Google's doing something shady, and again, I'm not defending all that they've ever done. I'm just saying that this example is such a reach. It's really silly and absurd uh, that the argument doesn't really hold up because these other sites aren't doing it. You go to Google, you type in mob, you get mob psycho 100. Now, I don't know, guys, what do you think is more relevant? Old flash mob videos from 2014 and 2013, maybe even further back that no one is even looking up nowadays? Or Mob Psycho 100, the anime that's getting more and more popular as anime is getting more and more popular. As I mentioned, My Hero Academia is like the second most watched show as a whole show, not anime, uh, as I mentioned in the other video. So no, I think Google has the right result here. I do think most people are looking up Mob if you want to raise an argument again that they're stifling results as a whole, totally fine. I'm not going down. I'm not going down that rabbit hole with you guys. I don't talk that much about politics. Uh, this is just related to anime, and uh, yeah, I don't think this is a fair point. What, what else can I say, man? As I said in the beginning of the video, any side can make a bad take. In, in my opinion, this is a bad take. I don't know what else you want me to tell you. Um, I guess maybe I'm wrong. Maybe maybe I'm out of the line here, but. I don't think that's the case. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And I appreciate you guys tuning in for this follow-up. And I appreciate you uh, voicing your comments when you disagree with me or agree with me. It's interesting stuff. And uh, those comments have spurred me to put more effort into this coverage that I originally should have put forward. I'll apologize about that. 
Sorry I didn't put the um, proper effort in the original video, my bad. But hopefully this update kind of, you know, uh, makes it a bit better. Thanks again for tuning in. Catch you next time.